That's all every every day ever is. Is a rush. This is like a, a full week almost by by tomorrow of this friggin' sore throat. And I'm beginning to wonder: is it strep or did that uh, PA physician's assistant when she was uh, getting in my ear? She was pressing real hard to the point that I kept choking. That's never happened to me before, so that made me wonder. At any rate, taking amoxicillin. Uh, hopefully that'll knock it out. I've gargled with salt water, but I can only do so much. It doesn't, it hasn't been helping. And Ma tried to come out and kick my ass. <laughs> she didn't catch me. <laughs> After she got hers kicked. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> oh. I'll tell you what. Chemtrail sky. It really is extreme out there, man. Very extreme. Rookie hour is over, 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 when this guy gets his gym. Made a new friend, Jerome, originally from New Zealand. He's been in the States for two years. He's a trainer at One Life and, and Snap, Snap. And uh, guess what? You freaking commies that were born here and don't like your country, get the hell out. He's a patriot. He's pro-Trump. He's pro-Patriot. He's, pro he's a Christian. A winning combo. But look at you commies that were uh, born here and watching fake news and vote, wanting to vote for commies. Unbelievable, man. <laughs> Unbelievable. But well, welcome aboard, Jerome. Up in Cleveland, he's in our he's in our resort park. He owns an RV there. Big flag, big flag, American flag, and and Trump. He's pro Trump. And I'm like, you're from Europe, and yet we got these jackasses that want to destroy our country in here. That's gonna be addressed later on. Jerome. It's unbelievable. And you know, it is always to be continued. Follow Sean. Yeah, you hear the jackasses flying up and down in the world's busiest dead end street. It's a, and also at Kroger, uh, Thomas Crossroads, it's friggin' nuts over there, man. They were at, they, they were almost out of the edge. They were out of my uh, juice, that Kroger brand that I need to get. It's unbelievable, man. Who does the order over there? You can't keep those damn shells stocked. They're parking like friggin' cooking like they're drunk over there in the parking lot. Damn jerks. Look at this guy. He missed about a quarter of the parking spot. No, that was actually me. I was dead set in the middle. That's right. The focus was. Uh, yeah, I belong at Duff's. But the thing is, uh, you know, they're parking crooked. You're John Cena when you go over there. They can't see you. They're going to walk behind you. You're going to drive behind you. You know, when you're trying to back out of your parking spot. It's unbelievable over there. Unfreaking real. And the traffic in the world's busiest dead-end streets, cr it's criminal, man. You should not have this much traffic in a in dead-end street. You know, I was so busy uh, filming the jackasses that don't know how to park at the Thomas Kroger parking lot that I left my block pocket, which blocks radiation from your cell phone when you have in your pocket, on the, in the damn shopping cart. Thank God the, uh, the guy, the kid that was a uh, guy, whatever, he's a teenager, was uh, taking care of the carts that he did the right thing and gave it to, um, you know, the, the front desk, lost and found. But yeah, the, the back to, you know, even when I went back there for a second time, they're parking crooked, crooked parking on the line. I mean, it's unbelievable. It's unbelievable. You got two friggin' lines. Two. And they can't seem to muster it up to keep it between the damn lines. Unbelievable, man. Unfreaking real. And they're, and they're hanging out in their cars over there at Thomas Crossroads parking lot. They're hanging out there. What the hell is going on? Is it that cell tower tampering with their frequencies? It's unfreaking real, man. Unbelievable. See how little I eat? Don't tell me I'm pushing 170 pounds. Get out of town with that mess. <laughs> 